Hello, my fabulous fundraisers. It's Kelly with Artisan Auctions. Today, we are going to be talking about four ways your caterers can help you raise more money at your fundraiser. And I'm going to share with you my tried and true catering service timeline for serving up success. Ready? Let's go raise some money. I know, I know, you're thinking, how on earth can my catering company possibly help us raise money? Well, they'll be keeping your guests happy with scrumptious food, but even more importantly, and the thing that can be easy to forget, the catering staff play an important role in helping to focus attendees on giving. And they'll do that by following a carefully crafted catering service timeline for the night. That way, the catering staff will be aware of when to be on the floor during the auction and when to vanish so the audience's attention can be on the fundraising. There are four ways they can help, so let's take a look at our timeline. First up, we wanna make sure the caterers deliver all the meals during the first half of the auction. This is the bare minimum you must ask of them, especially if your auction is split into two sections. During the first half of the live auction, we know not everyone is gonna be focused on the bidding, and that is okay. At this point, we want everyone to enjoy their meals and mild conversation. Service on the floor should be in good spirits and readily available for your guests. As we approach the midpoint, it is important that the catering staff suspend all service during the special appeal fund to need. This is critical, as we want the spotlight on the story that is being shared. If the caterers are moving throughout the room, this gives your audience permission to do the same, and we need them in their seats, ready to raise their bid cards. And here's a bonus tip. This is the best time to give your catering crew a 10 minute break. Let them know once the appeal video starts, all service halts. Once the appeal is complete, they can hit the floor with their spirited service and pick up where they left off. After the appeal is dessert. Dessert is the reward for giving. <laughs> and you'll be giving your guests the little sugar bump they need to complete the auction. And finally, request that your caterer leave all the cleanup until the end of the event after your guests have left the table. No one wants catering, sweep and clean the tables while they're trying to enjoy the rest of the program. This also helps to eliminate unnecessary movement through the room, creating less distractions from fundraising. And those are four ways your caterers can help you serve up success at your next fundraiser. Do you have a favorite catering company that you use for your fundraiser? Share your experiences and any questions in the comments below. And be sure to like and subscribe to Artisan Auctions for more videos on how to maximize revenue at your next fundraising event. See you next time.